Hello, Hello Floss, Floss Tube. Tube. We're the Real Housewives of Cross Stitch. I'm Priscilla. I'm Chelsea. I'm Cash. <laughs> this is Cash. And we're here to talk to you about our stitching this week. We're going to go a little bit out of order because Cash wants to show you the ornaments that have been in the Etsy shop this week. Um, we had our Black Friday sale, our Cyber Monday sale yes. on Monday. So thank you for all that participated in yes. that. And I hope I've gotten everybody that needed their charts, their charts, because mm -hmm. that was a long list. Um, okay, so in the Etsy shop this week, we finished off the Christmas... Um, kind of more religious things. In our Etsy shop. So go ahead. We started with what? Silent Night. Silent Night. Yep. Joy to the world. Joy to the world. Oh, no, you have to show them longer. They told us you have to show them longer because they want to well, see it. Maybe he should hand them to you and then you can hold it up. Joy to the okay. world. Next. Peace on Earth. Peace on Earth. Yep, this is Peace on Earth. Oh, Holy Night. Holy Night. Oh, Holy Night. I, I'll hold it. Nope. And this one was the one that was released on Wednesday. It's called Noel. Called Noel. What does it come with? Um, a bo bonus. Bonus. A bonus, bonus chart, yep. So this is Noel. It has the Cardinals, both sizes of sticky board that are available at Fat Quarter Shop. That's the stitching stripes in the aqua vintage trim in Cloud. The sandwich between is the ornaments from Hobby Lobby. Mm hmm you can also get those from um, Dollar Tree because those are the same size, but the beads are darker. They're more brownish. Yes. Yes. Um, you can always spray paint them if you can't find the Hobby Lobby versions. I like the dark beads too. They're all, they're very beautiful. Right. But the way that I've been doing them, I didn't want it to be No, changed. if you have it together. All right. All right. One more. And then you get to go play games. This is the vintage Christmas house. Yeah, or, I'm sorry, the Christmas house. Christmas house. Done on petal pink. Petal pink. Yep. Okay. That was Rit dyed, right? Rit dyed. Okay, that was Chelsea's checks in green. Chelsea's check in green. Yep. And then I took the red Chelsea's checks and I just folded it over. I actually ironed it and made it professional-ish. And then there's a little house on the back. But it's so cute. And the bow I did a little bit different. And I didn't add any greenery or anything. I thought that this was just perfect on its own. No, we don't need this yet. He's just going to show up. Okay. This is Santa's Skate Shop. He's just going to give you a tour. Uh, we're filming this a day early on Friday because we're all here. I forgot to put my Stitching with the Housewife sweatshirt on. We have uh, matching shirts because we no, are no, no, making no, 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 some. Not, 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 not yet. Not yet, yet baby. Not yet. <laughs> You can come back and show that and we'll, um, when we get to that part, okay? Say thank you. Thank you. Okay. okay. So I was a, a failure. I did not get the house tour up. Oh, yeah. I did finish the stitching, thank goodness. So we will show you that. And hopefully we are discussing it's either going to be Sunday or Monday that she's going to film. So I'm, I'm almost done. I, it's a lot. <laughs> you gotta be quiet when we're going okay babe all right so questions for this week um i looked all over priscilla's blog for million dollar salad or is it million dollar macaroni i thought i remembered million dollar i couldn't find it i'll put it on there next week it's million dollar macaroni and cheese and but there's like 50 different recipes that say that so i'll find the one that she makes and i will post that for you i'm curious about priscilla's bracelets they are so pretty can we see them up close <laughs> yeah, they're not polished. <laughs> yeah. uh, it's all Pandora. So yes. it's all Pandora terms. Uh, looking forward to the Monica tutorial. Will you please explain stitching over two? And then are the stitching seasons patterns going to be on sale in 2024? I love them, but didn't get signed up for time. In time. Yes. Yes. I thought they were talking about the newer ones. Yes, they will be. Yep. Okay. I was wondering what the chances are of getting a Christmas tree topper, like a star chart. How awesome would it be to have a pattern designed by Priscilla for the top of my housewife's tree? That would be nice. Very nice. Where did you get the spinning tree? Um, so I had, I bought the spinning tree originally from Hobby Lobby, like when they were 75% off and I bought like nine trees in one day. And that was probably 
10 years ago or more. It used to be the stripper tree is what we used to call or the hooker tree. Yes. What did we use to Because call it? it just like flashed all these different colors and it was really gaudy. You, you could <laughs> click the buttons to get it to more, but sometimes I'd just plug it in and it would be like, it, you know, it was real. Yeah. It was real. Who took that one home? You? No, it broke. No, it was still good. I kept the stand though. But know. then two years ago when I went to put up my tree, I could not find one of the legs to the stand. So I went on Amazon and I bought a a, a tree stand that spins, that make your, makes your tree spin. So I did get the second one on Amazon. And I, I found the leg last year, but then I can't find it because I would like to have both of those trees that are back in the corner spin. But I can't find it again. Yeah. So do you guys, oh, are you releasing a New Year's Day start piece? We haven't thought that far ahead, but <laughs> <laughs> well, shoot, it's like three times a week. So yeah. yeah. <laughs> Do you guys ever mix your floss strands like of one color and of another? No, no. Back when I used to use a lot of DMC, some of the charts would call for that. And it's, it's like a lot. <laughs> yeah. And we use the variegated floss, so it's already mm -hmm. got a lot of movement in yes. it. We don't want to add to it, I would think. I mean, yes. Yes. For some things, I think it would be pretty, like a roof on a house or something like that to make it look like a actual shingles. Um, when you dye your Monaco, does it make it soft? In other words, not so nice and stiff to stitch on. No, it's so stiff. It's Yeah, it's never like loose. When I got this from Chelsea, I had to iron it because it did, the wrinkles didn't even come out of it. It was so stiff. And it was on my Q-snap, which yeah. is... Yes, so I ironed that. Okay, that's what I have for questions this week. <clears throat> so we went on I gotta tell this story because it's gross but <laughs> we went on Monday to and I haven't told her yet we went on Monday to see some Christmas lights first we went to dinner then we went and saw some Christmas lights that you drive through and I came home and it was dark and I sat down and I, well I let the dogs out okay I already know <laughs> I already know no you don't yeah, I already know <laughs> It's either a four-legged friend or <laughs> it's bodily secretions or something. So I let the dogs out and Presley sometimes is a pain in the butt where she won't come back in. And it was like, oh my gosh. So finally I went out there and I got her. She came flying in the house and I keep a crate in the family room. The petunia goes in, but they both go in there to lay down and they both flew into the crate and just were wrestling around and stuff. And I thought it was just because they had, you know, missed me while I was gone or whatever. I stitched, they were in and out and everything was good. And then I fell asleep on the couch and I woke up and I stood up and there was a bedraggled dead mouse by my feet that you could tell it had been outside in the... Oh my God. So while I no. slept, they oh took it God. out of the cage where they apparently kept it. So then I were just to... tossing it like confetti. <laughs> to clean the cage, wash all their blankets and everything, Lysol it, and then I'm like, is that really a mouse or is it, because it, the cat has mouse toys, yeah. and I thought, like I thought Liberty had a squirrel toy, but then we found it in the garage and it was headless, so, <laughs> so gross. So at 10.30 at night, I'm, I'm finding my Uggs to kick it into a garbage bag. <laughs> your Shugs or your Uggs? Your shoe Uggs? So yeah. Which ones? <laughs> oh, sorry. Yeah, Sorry. so that was my excitement on Monday night. And, you know, when you wake up and you're just kind of like a little bit out of it and then you yeah. look down and you're like, because that thing, I, would have been, they would have been sleeping on the couch and I would have been upstairs. <laughs> you. you guys could clean it up. I have nobody else to clean it <laughs> yeah, up. Yeah, I'm talking about the dogs. You guys can clean it up. You can no. sit out here. No, the dogs but it they, up. they probably brought it to me like they were giving me a gift. Yes. Our, our cats that are outside leave gifts on the porch. Dead, <laughs> dead mice. We watch them. They go out in our acreage and they all just kind of fight over the mice. There's lots of mice out, like field mice type of things. It's gross. Yeah, it's gross. So they got that from your house? <laughs> no, they didn't. <laughs> they didn't. Yeah, yeah, you get this for kicking me out. Okay, I didn't know you were right there. Sorry. I kicked him in the head like three times. Sorry. I have socks on and they're nice. <laughs> All right, so that was what was in the Etsy shop. Again, we started with the vintage Christmas, so the roundabouts and the strippers will be in petal pink. Petal pink. Um, somebody asked for a thread list. I, we don't have a thread list yet. 
So a lot of you have already finished it, but this is now in our Etsy shop too because it's past December 1st. So you can get it at that quarter shop for our Jolly Housewife Stitch Along or you can get it in our Etsy shop. PDF. And this is North Pole Needleworks and that's the only way you're gonna get it, this PDF. There's no paper. Also, Santa's Skate Shop is in the Etsy shop and Vintage Christmas is in the Etsy yes. shop as well as yesterday's release, which was the um, the Christmas house. Also, and then our releases for December might come a little bit at a different schedule this, so we can get them out before Christmas. Oh, so that, hey, you can't be yelling. Um, but we'll see that. Don't spank grandma. I wanted to show you the set of four for the monthly weigh-ins. You saw the snowman already. Then for February, there's hearts. They're very cute. March is going to be chicks, and then we have bunnies for April. Yes. So you can get that set of four at Paisley's and Polka Dots to go with your monthly weigh-in. And then I'm going to show you the February monthly weigh-in. Just hold on to that so I can show the top up close first. Cash. Shh. I can't think. My, it's like <laughs> you're used to So this to it. is <laughs> February. Stitching stripes in white and red and Priscilla's pretty plaids in red and white. This is done on the 28 count Monaco. It's tea dyed already from Fat Quarter Shop. We bought it that way, but you could also tea dye white mm -hmm. and it would look just as fabulous. You could double dunk it. And there's the little topper. And then there's the hearts that go on the shelf. Oh, black squirrel just ran by, bedraggled and wet. It had a head. So there's our February Yes. Monthly These weigh -in. are going to be available to order this coming next week. week. Yep. They'll and then start shipping to shops. As long as the printer cooperates, yes. The printer will cooperate. We have to have the printer cooperate. I I, I was stitching like a maniac like two days ago. I woke up at four thirty and I didn't go to bed until eleven, trying to like get it done. I don't know. I'm I must be getting old or something. So we had our the first of the series we released at market and this was welcome home summer then we had the welcome home fall and it's a four-part series if you hadn't figured that out <laughs> so then this is this will also be released with the february welcome home winter it is so pretty there's cardinals and snow people and lots of snow and the home word. Oh, I just knocked that off the chandelier. The home word is, is hanging from the, it's too big to show okay. maybe. We're going to have a chandelier hanging. No, I'll fix it. Okay. So, what I, so this is that basket that came from Hobby Lobby in the spring section, and I know a lot of you have it, and it's just changed out with magnets and washers, but that's welcome home winter, and it's not Christmassy, it's more winter so that you can leave it up November through probably February, mm -hmm. and then there'll be a spring, spring welcome home. Also, I found one of the ornaments that I made with the round sticky boards. That's Hunter and his first corgi. But I think that they look so cute and it'll be such a nice addition to add to like all the squares on the tree. Tell them how you did it. Oh, I just used the round sticky boards and I just laid it on there. How did you determine what kind of picture would fit? Well, I, what you should do is you should put your sticky board on top of the picture and draw a circle and then cut it out. I oh, just good. like guessed. <laughs> and it turned out good. See? <laughs> but you want one, you want a rectangular picture that's going to be, or a square picture that has a yeah, lot of all background. The, all the ones I order, I order them from Walmart. They're like 13 cents a piece with free delivery. And because I think I have that Walmart thing, maybe that's why they're free. But they're 13 cents a piece. Where are you going to find an ornament for 13 cents? And then you have to buy the sticky board and the ribbon. ribbon. But, um, what was I saying? This, what size prints do you get? Oh, I get the four by four squares. And some of them I've even like trimmed down to be rectangle size. And then if your kids or grandkids have school pictures or like sports pictures, you use the little, what are they, like two by three or something? 
and those work really well too. So that's another ornament for the picture tree. For your picture tree. Somebody else showed their picture tree in that group. Right, and my, my tree is pretty full, so Chelsea said, well, you're gonna have to make the other tree in that corner, the other corner a picture tree too, so I might have to do that, we'll see. We're taking out the snowman tree. Is it a snowman tree still? No, it's the like tree farm red truck tree. Oh, the snowman it's ejected. tree got like narrowed down to one of those tall skinny things, and I haven't taken a tour yet. She did decorate the naked trees. They look good with the coughed up feather boa. I'll zoom in on that for the for the. Yeah, you can tell the part that she was. Yeah, it's out. mangled. It, it looks ratty. It looks like my Barbie clothes. Remember the Barbie clothes that I had like the fur around mouse. it. It looks like that that's mouse. Not, I don't, oh. That's so disgusting. So disgusting. I don't do anything like that. If there's a dead mouse, Matt comes and handles. I don't. Chelsea, I don't. Even look I at live it. by myself. Hunter okay. lives a minute away. I would call him it and say. It was ten thirty at night. Your sister. <laughs> He's awake. Your sister needs you. That's what you would say. <laughs> Your sisters threw up a thing and they need you. <laughs> All right. I got some haul. Oh, I have not. Ugh. I have not. Uh, the light show we went to was in Caledonia. It's at Jellystone Campground. So I used this 80-20 batting mm -hmm. for, like, the finishes. And for Quilt As You Go, this is this is the batting we've used, and we enjoy it. So I've used a lot of the Stitching with the Housewives ribbon on my trees. Oh. I've used the skinny stuff and the bigger stuff. And I needed a bunch of the skinny stuff for ornaments. And then I needed a new hoodie. Sticky board. More sticky board and some floss. That's it. A lot of your comments had to do with raw turkeys. Um, one like pies that are burnt to a crisp. Um, lots of funny stories. No bathroom humor at the table. Yes, we have that issue too when we have new <laughs> people. Um, and a lot of you, I have to go rewatch the video because a lot of the comments said I had a lot of caffeine or something that I was on one. It's, it's always <laughs> the case. Always too much caffeine. Uh, what's new at Fat Quarter Shop? do si -do. Quilt pattern. We saw Wish this week and it was really cute. Uh, Pearl Chicken Club. This is by Lori Holt. This is Pearl. I love that name, Pearl. My friend's daughter's name is Pearl. Millie's I had dresses. A great aunt that her name was Pearl. Yeah. That bedroom that set that's upstairs and that that, yeah. that came from my her. room. Mm-hmm. My room. She doesn't call it my room anymore. It's a Santa Claus room. Right. It's not your you know, like that's my room. Even if somebody else lived in it afterwards, it's still gonna be my room. Millie's dresses. Uh <laughs> no. two by two. Well, we know who loved it. <laughs> <laughs> uh do drops quilt pattern mary and joseph okay they don't know um and you can catch <laughs> november stackables so that's what's new we'll have some of these to give away at the end of the video yes we will when we remember all right so what was your plan for the releases for these we're doing three what do you mean before to get them out before Christmas. Yes, so we're gonna try to do three a week of the, the all of the pink things. So we'll, it'll kind of be it'll. I mean, how does that work? Because you have it'll be random for the roundabout and the. Mm -hmm. Um, I my family's going on vacation. She might meet us down there. You guys can talk her into it. Um, so they will. I said I was gonna decide by Monday. Now it's already Friday. So. Oh, I thought you meant last or this coming one day okay i'll decide by this one day i got my tsa pre-check thank the lord so now we don't have to have any of those issues that we had there because all <laughs> i kept reading is that mco has the worst lines right now like over three four hours that mm -hmm. you're waiting in security line and it'll still be long with tsa pre-check but it'll be less long and we won't have to rent a car and get the wrong hotel room and all of that like we did in Asheville. so it'll never happen again 
<laughs> It'll never happen again. Yep. And then I stay with her, even though I have TSA pre-check. And then we get to the line and she's like, she's gonna, if they have one ticket, I'm going. And I'm like, I did not, I did not say that. She did. No, she I did. did. She did. You, your boobs are going to shrink because that is not, so. that is not true. I said, you go and make, go get my son if, to take him to school. That is not true. I said, I would no. sleep in the airport. I was not going to leave you by yourself. Maybe we don't All right. I hope so. Okay. Um, let, what else did we do this week? I don't know, but apparently you've been teaching your kid bad words. <laughs> that's uh, or, and that's not a bad word, it's an anatomy, anatomy word. I don't think that's it in the anatomy book. <laughs> well, I'd I was just trying to see gingerbread cookies breath. is back here, and I put out the December monthly weigh-in, but I don't have another scale, so with having to have February on it, there it is right there. It's displayed like that. I still haven't gotten my Fitz and Floyd out to What's put the cabinet. Or... No, nope. that's enough. Thank you. Or any of my I other. Yeah. No more. Five pounds. Something just happened in there too that it sounds like a lot of fall down. It's fine. Okay. We had giveaways last week. Let's get through that. I need a stiff drink. <laughs> um, the first one is Oh Holy Night. Three opportunities to win this. This is a PDF. That goes to Carolyn Wong, 005, Kim Ray, 6752, and 5L Smith. Then Farah. Where's Farah? Farah Foxit. She comes with a bonus chart. That goes to Patricia Kalisak, 4300, Tiffany Why Not, and Rodeo Doe, Gmail, 1161. We went computer shopping. Hate, 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 hate. Uh, <laughs> oh, we tried P.F. Chang's. I liked it. She was like unamused. Mm. She was like, eh. We got the filet mignon wan dumpling things, wontons. Mine tasted like lighter fluid. Because they set them on fire there. So mm -hmm. like, no, it did. It tasted like lighter fluid. I don't know. I enjoyed mine. I, I got peppered steak or something like that. And he got Mongolian beef. She got orange chicken. Okay. All right. Or sweet and sour chicken. You're going to stretch my socks out. Please don't do that. All right, have kids. They said it'll be fun. Be merry. Be merry. Donna Garvin, 3633, Melody Caranco, and Martha Cook. Okay, I can't play sorry until I'm done. Thank you. Ho, ho, ho. I'm back. Janet Householder, 2696, Marie Shaw, 4649, and Connie Sam. Good. The next one is Be Jolly. Be Jolly. This goes to Tammy Raymond, 4517, Dee Dee Lambert, and Marilyn Lutensky, 9196. And then Believe. Believe. That goes to Christine Plumstead, Sabrina Erickson, 5168, and Joyce Klauser, 3371. This is done on the... Evening blue. Evening blue, and it's tea coffee dyed, and I think the colors really pop on there. Mm -hmm. These are some of my favorites. Um, then we had gingerbread cookies. Gingerbread cookies. Jamie Bassesi, 3869, Jody Odorico, 772, and Linda Cassius, 8800. That is a PDF. All right, no. then from Fat Quarter Shop. Nope. From Fat Hi. Quarter Shop. No. All right, all right, all right. Sell them. Have you been drinking coffee today? Here, the French country linen. Show them that. Thank French. you, Kimberly and team. Bonnie DeCosta, 8003, and Vanessa Bryce. So those are physical items, so I need you to send me your physical address in order to send them. Then we have the Ada. Goes to Lori Hausler, 867, and Rebecca Journey, 3183. Then, ooh, from... Creative Carol, she sent us these folios. It's a uh, like a fall thankful folio. This goes to Renee Day 84, Lindsay Zachman, TN Bluebird, and Michelle Farmgal. And these need to be, I need a physical address to send these to. 
Then from Fat Quarter Shop, Kimberly and Team, the So Sampler box. It doesn't get opened. It just goes like that. Made for you by Sue and Nancy Finney 1314. And then last but not least, it's a PDF. It's the Gingerbread Adorables. Which, oh, it's behind you. Uh, moved. Careful. Careful. Two hands, please. The house is done by Paisleys and Polka Dots, and she gives you information on how to uh, make, like, the fake snow and things. It's a product that she buys to do that. Bob and Julie Johnston, 8327. Christina Fox, 13. And CINN, 1217. Though that's a PDF, so just send me your email address and I can send it out to you. Again, I, all right, all right, for all right, right now, stop. I've caught up on what um, I have as far as giveaways. I was trying to get my computer set up. Okay, number one is three opportunities to win Noel. And this will come with the bonus chart. Oh, I need to show this. So I totally had glue all over the back of it, so I had to add a bow and a little wreath on the back. Right <laughs> Number two is three opportunities to win the Christmas house. Where did this come? Number two. All right, don't wipe it on your shirt. Go ahead, go on up, down. Hallelujah. Number two. Number three. What are you giving away today? The North Pole Needle Workshop. Yes. Number three is five opportunities to win North Pole Needleworks, and that's a PDF. Number four is Jar of Jingles, right? Jingle Jar? Jingle Jar, maybe. Number four. From Fat Quarter Shop, number five is do -si do three opportunities to win that. Number six is three opportunities to win Millie Dresses, Millie's Dresses. Number seven, um... Three opportunities to win the two by two and the dew drops. Did they get both? Yeah. Number seven. Number eight. You get pearl. Okay. What else do you have to give away? You have this one too. Should probably give that away. Number nine. Three opportunities to win November stackables. And then ten. And guys, I three opportunities to win. Santa's okay, speech. I think that we're all done. We we had our um, all of our giveaways, and then your question that you're going to answer to enter for the giveaways is which of these three is your favorite? So the two on the ends, the monthly weigh in February and the welcome home winter, will be available in your shops starting to ship next week. So you can look for them in paper form in your shops. This North Pole Needleworks is only available by PDF in our Etsy shop or at fatquartershop.com. So I would think that you can get on a pre-order for the Welcome Home Winter and the February Monthly Weigh-In. And we want to know which one of these three is your favorite. So just do that. Put your numbers mm -hmm. and you'll be entered to win. Like the video, be a subscriber. Follow us on Instagram at Priscilla Blaine at Chelsea356, Priscilla's2000 on Facebook and Priscilla's2000.blogspot.com. And I'll remember to post that recipe for the million dollar macaroni. Yes. On my blog this week. And I'm trying to think if we have anything else that's so yesterday was December 1st. So it starts Jolly Housewives. So it's all, we're going to be doing all Christmas stitching with Fat Quarter Shop. And they still have some of our shirts available. This was from two years ago. And the one that I usually wear is last year's. <laughs> the house is the yeah. end to all. Good night. Yes. You can also get the Christmas bag on their website. That is for your stitching as well. Mm -hmm. Yep. Okay. Is that it? Yeah. Okay. We appreciate you spending your time with us. And yes. then you'll, you can look forward to the house tour next week. Yes. All right. We will see you guys next week. Bye. Bye.